Hey, this is Lauren with TMF Apparel, and today I'm going to show you how I wet cap my DTG printer. This one's going to be the uh, Air Ren T800. It's a Chinese model DTG that I use. Inside of it is the Epson 3880. That is what the guts is. So if you have an Epson-based printer, this will be helpful if you need to learn how to wet cap your system. This will keep your print head wet, allowing it to avoid clogs, especially on the white inks overnight. All right, what we're going to do on the Epson 3880, and this might be on some other printers it's in a different spot. Um, this setup here is a 3880 that's in this DTG machine. So if you have one, you might, um, that's not in a DTG setup, that's the complete machine. You're going to have to take off the side access panel to get to this little wheel right here. And we can rotate this that direction away from you to release the print head. And what we want to do is put a little bit of solution into this capping station right here. What I like to do is let that sit in there for a minute. <clears throat> and then I like to soak it up. And uh, what you have is this print head comes over and docks in there. And it docks directly on this little rubber gasket. When you run a print head cleaning, the print head docks to the capping station and the pump pulls ink through the bottom of the print head as if it were printing something to help flush out whatever's in it. So what I like to do is just soak this up because this will have a bunch of ink in it and over time it gets kind of gross. So you want to keep this little station right here pretty clean and I have some swabs for that as well. Um, if you want to see what it does when we rotate this, we can see that it comes up and hits that print head, seals to it. Right, and we can also wipe off our, our little wiper blade there. Um, if there's any ink on that, you can just pull it off with your fingers. Sometimes it'll get a little bit of dried ink on there, which this is what's wiping the bottom of the print head, so it's good to have that clean. Then what I like to do is fill this guy up right here. <coughs> and then I like to just power down the printer. And what it's gonna do Go back into its place and seal the print head to the wet cap station. Once it's sealed up there, that is wet capped. Now in the morning, when you turn the printer back on, it's gonna go side to side. You wanna make sure that there's no liquid still sitting in the wet cap station because it will stick to the bottom of the print head, have little bubbles. You go to print your first garment or your first DTF transfer, and it's gonna leave a nice streak right across it because it's literally just dangling from it. Um, safe bet, run a head clean in the morning before you start printing. That will make sure that everything out of it is gone. I hope this was helpful. Watch for some more tips.